Hi, I am K Prakash. In the previous videos, we have discussed about the about the IC engine basics, and then we have discussed about the two stroke, four stroke, and then we have made the performance test on IC engines. We have discussed. Now we are going to deal a case study. So, why this performance uh, test and this uh, heat balance test were studied? Although now, what is the trend going on? So, what is the major disadvantages in the IC engines? So, if you take the major disadvantages, first is the basically the fuel used is a fossil fuel. So, the fossil fuels is depleting day by day. So, this is a major setback, and the hike in the fuel price is the second major setback where the fuel price is hiking day by day. So, the middle class family or the all the members in the in India and all over the world are facing the same hike in this fuel prices and next third major thing is the pollution so the exhaust smoke or the exhaust gas from the IC engines is leading to global warming so as the ozone layer is depleting day by day by the unwanted pollutants from these IC engines or vehicles or from industries are it's giving a major setback. So how to rectify this? So this is the empathy part in a design thinking approach. So we have already know that what is empathy. It is the first stage of design thinking. So we are have, we are finding the what are the problems in the existing system. So although now mostly some ninety percentage we are using the IC engines, but we are having lot of empathy in this. So we are next. We are going to define. So how to overcome these major empathy parts? That is the fuel price, the depletion of the fossil fuels, and then the pollution. So these three things have been taken, and we have to go for define, and we have to give an idea or give a solution for this empathy part. So what is the alternate thing is the electrical vehicle technology EV. So this is the major thing attached with this IC engines. A yeah, normally an IC engine can be converted with the help of an electrical energy and it can be made run through this electrical energy. So this concept is introduced. So that concept is called as electric vehicles. So what is the advantage in this? So here, instead of the fuel, what we are doing is we are using a solar panel to get the solar energy, and this solar panel is converted into current where it is used to charge the batteries. So the energy stored in the batteries is meant to move the vehicles. So this is electric power. So when we are using this, so if the first condition is that. The solar energy is a renewable energy, as it is obtained free of cost, and then it is not de getting depleted. It can't be depleted. It is abundant, and it is we can get it till our lifetime. And there is no pollution by using this solar energy. So what the empathy we have discussed is solved by this shifting into this solar energy. So here, initially we, use, we are using the solar panels, which can be fixed on the top of the vehicles. So and then this solar energy can be directly converted by using the concept called as solar photovoltaics. So solar photovoltaics is the direct conversion of this light energy into electrical energy. So this energy is used to charge the battery, and with the help of these batteries, the vehicle can be made move. So. So, as day by day this global warming is becoming more and more, when we shift over to this electric vehicle, then we can support uh, our uh, environment to be sustainable in the future. And also, by switching over to this solar energy, so the energy can be harvested with free of cost. But initially, the investment for the solar energy is. Little bit more, whereas the returns is very 
high when compared to the IC engine storage. So another setback is that in the solar energy, so the fuel cost day by day are spending day by day. But here initially the fuel cost or the uh, setup is equal to the installation of this solar power. And in the next coming days what happens is we are not spending any money for this solar power. So this concept can be introduced in the uh, IC engines or in vehicles to convert the existing uh, vehicles with the powered with IC engines to solar powered vehicles. So it may be a two wheeler or maybe a four wheeler. So in the future to have a more sustainable and future environment to be go green with the nature. So we have to shift with the uh, electric vehicle technologies. Thank you.